Hello, and welcome to Uncle Bill's Kitchen. We're going to use the slicing method for this lettuce because it makes it much easier to handle when we're rolling the burrito. By putting large pieces of lettuce in your burrito it makes it quite difficult to roll. The type of tomato that you use is completely up to you. I had some cherry tomatoes in my refrigerator so that's what I'm using for my burritos. Let me know in the comments down below which ones you like the best. We are halfway through the cooking process for these tater tots. Give them a little shake in the basket so where the heat is coming from the top hits different sides of the tots. You want to make them nice and crispy. You're getting it done. You're getting it done right. Milk is an option that you can add to your eggs to make them fluffier and lighter. If you don't like milk or you can't use it, just omit it completely from the recipe. It won't hurt it at all. I'd like to take this time to thank you guys for watching the video. It really helps my channel out a lot and gives me the opportunity to do what I love, which is provide amazing content to all of you. If you have any recommendations of what you'd like to see next, make sure to leave them in the comments down below. By taking a damp cloth and putting it between the plate and the tortilla, it keeps the tortilla from sticking to the plate when you microwave it. Also, by putting the other half in between the next layer of tortilla, it offers a way to give moisture to all two of the tortillas you're cooking. Putting your ingredients on correctly is very important. If you miss a step or you put the wrong ingredient first, it makes it more difficult to roll your burrito. For example, putting lettuce on before your cheese doesn't allow the cheese to melt when you add the other hot items on there.
by putting your tater tots on the outside of your stacked produce, what it's going to do is give you something to actually grab onto when you start to roll your burrito. Hey fam, do you like this type of content? Let me know in the comments down below and I'll keep doing it. Hello and thanks for coming back to Uncle Bill's Kitchen. I hope you've enjoyed today's episode. If you did, please be sure to hit that like button and subscribe. It lets you know every time a new video comes out so you can come back and give us your support. Hey, if you'd like to give more support, we have a Patreon page. If the Patreon is too much, we also have Ko-Fi. Come by and buy me a cup of coffee. Links in the description below.